Hi, Lindy Bowen here from StampingWithLindy.com, your cardiologist since 1997, helping you create cards from the heart. This week we uh, released an early release bundle that will be available in the new January through June mini catalog. And it comes with a suite of products that has some exclusive items in them. And one of them is the beautiful Garden Gems and the Designer Series Paper um, Eaton, um, Ever Eaton Specialty Paper. Love that it's got this gold in it. So today's just a little uh, tip video on how to use these two products. Now what I did was I took the dies um, from that die set and I actually cut out my Designer Series Paper. Now that's something that I normally don't do and so it just gives a different look. There's a lot of neat little borders and um, leaves in this um, die set. So I cut that out of the designer series paper. I took my gold foil and did some leaves. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that die cut and grab my multi-purpose glue. Now I could have used the sticky on paper when I die cut this, but I have used it on so many other projects. I'm waiting for an order to come in. So I'm just going to use the Tombow um, multi-purpose glue. Of course you don't want to put too much glue, but you want enough glue to hold it in place. So we're just going to add those little dots of glue. Then I have a piece of soft succulent and we are going to adhere that to that piece. Isn't that pretty? I really like the way the Designer Series paper uh, shines um, through with that dye. Now you'll see the sun is coming out um, here in Ohio, which was a cloudy day. And so I've got some sun coming on. Uh, let me see if I can just close that blind a little bit so we don't have so much glare. Hate to shut the sun off here in Ohio this time of the year. So we've got that. Next, what I'm going to do is I am going to grab some glue dots. If I have some glue dots here, uh, boy, I'm batting 100. Let's go ahead and just use my adhesive around this to add those gold foil leaves. This designer series paper is just so pretty with um, the gold flakes. Um, but of course on the back side of it it's plain so if you don't want every card to have a lot of gold on it. So you've got that. I'm going to bring in... Huh, I don't even see that. Boy, I'm batting a hundred. I wanted to stamp in the middle of that. I'm going to go ahead and put this on my piece of Evening Evergreen. Now I have already embossed that with the um, Time Worn um, embossing folder. So I really um, wanted to stamp first, but since my adhesive is on there, let's see what happens. Take Dear Friend, How Are You? and stamp in the middle. And there, we got a good um, stamping. So we're going to take that and add that to our card. Of course, this is a five and a half by eight and a half, and we've already scored it at the four and a quarter. Just gonna add some adhesive. And then I wanted to show you a fun little way to use these garden gems. These garden gems have a like little, I'm calling it a cat's eye. I don't know um, what it would be called. Um, and I'm just going to put them in the four corners. And there is just a different way to add our embellishment. Usually we add it right to our card. But I just thought this was pretty cool to put them in the four corners. And then we can go back in. with the smaller ones and add them to each side. 
So really add some elegance to the card. You can put them on the end like here or in the center, which or the side of the card, whichever you like. Uh, let's see, I'm putting it this way. Let's go ahead and add that. And then I'll show you how I did it with the other card with them facing the other ways. Again, these Garden Gems and the Designer Series Paper are a limited edition. Um, so once supplies are gone, they're gone and they will not be available. These Garden Gems kind of have a blue and green um, tint to them, but just a fun way to add a little um, interest to the corners of your cards. Again, I did it so that the smaller one was in the corner and then double um, cat's eyes. So just a different way to use it. Hope you've enjoyed today's video. We'll talk to you real soon. Bye-bye.